<clears throat> the darkness of night is. You're really going through with this? Going through with what? Using that ridiculously expensive magical item to broadcast your biased opinions on how the world works. I'm confused. I thought you wanted me to do something now that we are retired. Yeah, like starting a guild. Perhaps teaching at one of the academies nearby. Or helping your daughter find out who she is. That girl is fine the way she is. I got her brawling with my customers. Our customers lose in breath. It was most of my fortune that built this place in the middle of nowhere. Fine. I got your daughter brawling with our customers. At the rate it is good to brawl. Oh, so you're going to be paying for the healing potions and the cleric fees. I guess you should pay if it causes severe damage, but you and I both know that people will go to a cleric for a splinter. Your silver tongue! You've gone to a cleric for less than a splinter. Are you referencing the time I was impaired by a branch when we were hired to kill those giants in the Isca Ida? Regardless of that, that stone. You really want to paint a target on your back? My old friend, our clocks are both stopped until those fire rings hit their mouth. And I say that will come. Why do you tempt the fates? If fate didn't want me to walk the line between dead and alive, they wouldn't have given me a second chance. <clears throat> the darkness of night has fallen. The shadows have risen. The undead who wait for the purity of the sun to fall are looking, just like the thoughts of a madman.